Health Sciences LRT station opened January 1, 2006 as the south terminus of the light rail line. However, it became quickly apparent that there was an issue with the surrounding facilities designed to handle the foot traffic. The crosswalk connecting the station and the core of the U of A campus created a huge rush hour congestion with the pedestrian flow. Construction on the LRT overpass started January 2012 and was expected to be completed in December. However, midway in June, there was no roof and just a clear view of the sky. By October, there was still no roof, but a few beams had crossed 114th Street. On January 2nd, 2013, the pedway looked like it was finished with just glass missing. To be completed spring 2013, I don't know if it will really be completed spring 2013. May 2013, five months overdue, the pedway looks completed, but it's still not open. Finally, in June 2013, the pedway was quietly open to the public, but notice how some of the exterior is still not ready. Through the eastern end of the pedway, you can connect to the U of A and Stollery Hospital, Mazinkowski Alberta Heart Institute, and the rest of the U of A campus through pedways. On the south end, you can connect to the new K Edmonton Clinic. And on the north end, you can connect to the Edmonton Clinic Health Academy. The connection to the Jubilee Auditorium is by ground level on the station itself. The Northern Alberta Jubilee Auditorium is only steps away, which is why the station was renamed to add Jubilee in 2009. In 2014, the station will once again be a terminus station when the Metro LRT line is commissioned. And that's my latest Yegg venture. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, share and subscribe for more.